We've been flooded with phone calls and emails from you about what you saw around 11 last night. We've been looking up at the sky, commenting on how it's cleared because the cloud formations have been so pretty earlier in the day. Until they saw this from their Covington home. I looked up and there was a bright green flash and we just saw the comet go that way. We both jumped out to the alley and stood here and watched. It had a green tail, very bright, and it disappeared off that way. Seen a bright green light going through the sky, um, big huge orange tail on it was able to tell my husband, you know, hey, what is that over there? So what's happening is when the object re-enters the Earth's atmosphere, it's uh, burning up. And what we're seeing that is that, you know, the, the illumination from essentially the object being on fire. And uh, what color it is will depend on the materials it's made out of. We talked to Dr. Jason Dybel at Wright State University, and he says what he saw was similar to this, an extra bright meteorite called a fireball. When they call it a fireball, a fireball is still a meteorite. It's just one that is just more visually uh, able, you know, we're very able to visually see it because it's very bright. Dr. Dybul says many of us saw the fireball because of this track. It started uh, entering the atmosphere somewhere above, I would say, south central Ohio, and then went north for a while. And that's why you saw it over so many states. And many others heard or felt the fireball. More than likely felt was the sonic boom, actually, that uh, the uh, there's a type of fireball called a bolide sometimes, where the uh, fireball will actually start, you know, breaking up and exploding. And so you may, they may have felt the sonic boom from that explosion or just the sonic boom from the fact it was moving very fast in the Earth's atmosphere. Yuna Lee, New Center 7. Oh.